Welcome to our channel. In today's video, we'll be diving into comprehensive step-by-step -step guide on organic wheat farming. If you're passionate about sustainable agriculture and looking to maximize your yields without relying on synthetic chemicals, you're in the right place. Organic wheat farming is not only better for the environment but also for your health. So let's get started and transform your farm into a thriving organic wheat heaven. Don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the notification bell for more farming tips and tricks. The first step in organic wheat farming is selecting the right wheat variety. There are numerous varieties to choose from, each with its own benefits and growing requirements. When choosing, consider factors such as your local climate, soil type and disease resistance. Hard red wheat, for example, is great for bread making and has a robust growth pattern. Soft white wheat, on the other hand, is ideal for pastries. Opting for a variety well suited to your region will enhance your chances of a successful high yield harvest. Researching and consulting local agricultural extensions can provide valuable insights. Preparing the soil is crucial for a healthy wheat crop. Organic wheat farming relies heavily on soil fertility and structure. Begin by testing your soil to determine its pH level and nutrient content. Wheat prefers a slightly acidic to neutral soil pH 6.0 to 7.5. Incorporate organic matter such as compost, manure or cover crops to improve soil fertility. This not only provides essential nutrients but also enhances soil structure and water retention. Avoid synthetic fertilizers. Instead, focus on building a robust soil ecosystem through natural amendments. Regularly rotating crops and practicing no-till farming can also boost soil health. Sowing seeds correctly is vital for good germination and healthy plant growth. The optimal time for sowing wheat seeds varies depending on your region. In general, spring wheat is sown in early spring while winter wheat is sown in the fall. Use a seed drill to plant seeds at the depth of 1 to 1.5 inch and space them about 7 to 8 inches apart. Ensure even distribution to prevent overcrowding, which can lead to competition for nutrients and water. Organic wheat seeds are preferred as they are untreated and free from synthetic chemicals. Weed control is one of the biggest challenges in organic wheat farming. Weeds compete with wheat for nutrients, water and light. Organic farmers use various techniques to manage weeds naturally. Crop rotation is an effective method. Rotating wheat with legumes or cover crops can disrupt weed growth cycles. Mechanical weeding tools such as hose or weeders can be used to manually remove weeds. Mulching with organic materials like straw can also suppress weed growth. Encourage a diverse ecosystem with beneficial insects and birds can help keep weed populations in check. Managing pests and diseases organically requires vigilance and proactive strategies. Regularly inspect your weed fields for signs of pests such as aphids, armyworms and weed stem sawflies. Beneficial insects like ladybugs and lacewings can help control pest populations. Neem oil and insecticidal soaps are effective organic treatments. For diseases like rust, powdery mildew and blight, select disease resistant wheat varieties and practice good crop rotation. Maintaining proper plant spacing and ensuring good air circulation can reduce the incidence of fungal diseases. Organic fungicides and biocontrol agents can also be used if necessary. Efficient water management is essential for a successful organic wheat crop. Wheat requires consistent moisture, especially during the critical stages of germination and flowering. Drip irrigation and sprinkler systems are effective methods that ensure even water distribution while conserving water. Avoid over irrigation as it can lead to root diseases and nutrient leaching. Mulching can help retain soil moisture and reduce the need for frequent watering. Monitor soil moisture levels regularly and adjust irrigation schedules based on weather conditions and crop needs. 
Harvesting wheat at the right time is crucial to maximize yield and quality. Wheat is typically ready for harvest when the grains are hard and the plants have turned golden brown. Use a combined harvester for efficient harvesting. After harvesting, it's important to properly clean and store the wheat to prevent spoilage and pest infestations. Dry the grains thoroughly before storing them in a cool, dry place. Use airtight containers or grain bags to protect the wheat from moisture and pests. Regularly check stored wheat for any signs of spoilage or pest activity. Organic wheat farming is a rewarding endeavor that promotes sustainable agriculture and produces high quality nutritious grains. By following these steps, selecting the right variety, preparing the soil, sowing seeds correctly, managing weeds, controlling pests and diseases, practicing efficient irrigation and handling post-harvest processes, you can achieve a successful bountiful organic wheat harvest. Thank you for watching our step-by-step -step guide to organic wheat farming. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and share it with fellow farmers. Subscribe to our channel for more organic farming tips and stay tuned for our next video. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions or want to share your organic wheat farming experiences, leave a comment below. We love hearing from our viewers. Don't forget to check out our other videos on sustainable farming practices. Until next time, happy farming.